Greetings and welcome back to Pillars of Eternity, where we are still posing as priests. The most hodgepodge collection of priests you'll ever lay your eyes on, but uh, thankfully for us, most of these guys seem remarkably naive. They'll just accept whatever we tell them. I approve. But we have probably exhausted most of my ability to lie. We flat out just don't have the resolve at this point to be able to just bluff them. And my intelligence is very rapidly reaching the point where uh, no more... Ooh, wait a second. Oh, we should have been sneaking around like this before. Of course, because it's not just stealth. It's also you're looking for hidden things. And we have found a hidden thing right here. Thank you. That will go into the stash. Uh, I think we should probably try to go down. If indeed we can. Yes, we can. Well, let's see. Let's see where this takes us. It could take us somewhere terrible. Okay. Ooh, we're in the dungeons? Why would I want to be somewhere like this? Hmm. I stop being stealthy. No. Stealth definitely does uh, still show that up. Uh, no, we're not going to play around in the dungeons just yet. Perhaps I should, because I might be able to find those uh, soldiers that I need to help. But for now, my primary concern is to try and get through these doors. Now, I'm not sure how these lockpicks are going to work. I'm really hoping that... Uh, It'll allow us to go through. Four mechanics plus five lock. Oh, right. Okay. Damn. Okay. We flat out can't get through there then. Hmm. Then where do we go next? Were there any doors that we had missed? I'm not at all sure. Oh, there's a, something hidden in the dresser there. Take that. The Life and Discoveries of Pandgram. Mention the name Pandgram to anyone with even a passing knowledge of animancy and you could find yourself in for a very long discussion. Publicit uh, publicly reviled but privately lauded as a hero and genius, Pandgram's history is, that, is at turns revolutionary, horrific and mysterious. Pandgram was fascinated, some might say obsessed, with the concept of animancy. It consumed his life as he dedicated everything to understand it. He would frequently travel to Air Glanfath and the Deerwood to visit the Egwithian ruins. There he would take notes and make sketches, bringing anything back with him that he could f that he could to help him unlock the mysteries. After years of study, Pandgram had reached the point where he could no longer conduct research on his own, and he took on an assistant, Helig of Thane. Soon, Helig was making trips to Air Glanfath in Pendgram's stead, gathering knowledge while Pendgram stayed behind to experiment. This partnership quickly bore fruit, and Pendgram made a breakthrough, one that would, that would irrevocably change his life and the general attitude about animancy forever. While the specifics of his experimentation will never truly be known, the rumours and stories that still circulate tell that he had sent out inquiries asking for live subjects to help with a dangerous experiment that might change their life, or might end it. Those who were already dying were especially encouraged to apply. Response was overwhelming, and Pandgram had his pick of numerous willing bodies. That is when he found his breakthrough. He discovered a way to fix a soul anchoring it to its body so it couldn't leave at death. He had discovered eternal life. My lord, that's rather sudden. His research and life's work had resulted in the greatest single discovery that Anamancy could hope for. His findings were published and quickly spread through Valia and beyond, while some groups, the Wodican uh, Church, for example, decried his work as nothing more than blasphemy and heresy. Many put it to practice. Everyone wanted the chance at immortality, but everything comes with a cost. It quickly became apparent that simply restraining the soul while keeping the person technically alive was doing nothing for the body, which continued to decay, devolving and warping, the soul now trapped inside it. The creatures it created were dangerous. 
carnivorous beasts that killed brutally and indiscriminately. The backlash was ruthless. The practice of uh, Pandgram's discoveries was outlawed. His works were collected and burned. He and Halleck were branded heretics and hunted, chased from town to town, until Pandgram simply vanished. Halleck was tracked down, captured, and brought to trial for the atrocities committed against Valia and its people. The trial was barely more than a formality to bring charges against him, as everyone knew that he had played in the disaster. He was sent to prison for years, but eventually released once public outrage died down. Not long after his parole, he disappeared as well. Occasionally, talk surfaces that a copy of Pangram's theorems has been found and touched by the purging flames that destroyed its brothers. These rumours seldom end up being more than that. Many groups and wealthy individuals have formed sending out call to anyone who will listen. Find us a copy of the theorems. They offer gold, jewels, status, anything they can to entice adventurers to help them achieve their goals. For there are those who would give anything at a chance at immortality, even becoming a monster. Fair enough. That was actually a pretty cool read. What do I need? <laughs> Never gonna happen. Was there anything over here? I don't think there was. Okay, well, it looks like the uh, dungeon it is for us. Alas. How close are we to our level? Still a ways off. You'll tend to find with this game, levels don't come from killing things. That's not how you level up in this game. It's exploring, it's achieving quests. So we need a quest, or we need areas to explore that will offer us an, a, a, an opportunity to level up. There we go. Uh, well, actually, yeah, let's head down. I don't think there's anywhere else for me to investigate right now. As much as I don't want to do this, What's that? I can get through there. This is going to be a bad move. There's going to be some horrible experiment down here, isn't there? We are going to pay for this curiosity. In blood, more than likely. But maybe we'll find those soldiers. Oh, well. Wow. Or find huge amounts of treasure. I approve. Ooh, more memorials. They're all over the place. I'm just scrolling through the names just in case you happen to spot yours if you were one of the one of the backers. I, I'm not gonna read everything out, but if you do happen to uh, spot one of yours, then do let me know and I will uh, come back. If you tell me exactly where it was, I'll come back and I'll read it. What have we got over here, then? Okay, slow down. Cool. Let's keep going this way, then. Let's not play with those monstrosities. Not yet. We'll explore this place first. Oh, is this the uh, sewer, perhaps? Oh, another ghoul? Something over there. Oh, yeah, 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 Yes? That was potentially hor horrific. The work of a moment. Can we keep trying? The work of a moment. The work of a moment. You get a reverend. Well, it doesn't look like we're getting through there. Does anyone have better mechanics? One. Three. Zero. Three. I'll have you give it a try anyway. What? That's settled. Damn it! I'm here. Ah, you've shown us up. Oh, well, you haven't actually, but... All right, what are we going to find over here, then? Anything terrible? Not yet. But there's every possibility that something terrible is lurking around the corner, just waiting, watching. It's reverent over there. Don't want to play with it. A simple test. 
I'll well, that's, handle this. That's painfully easy to do. Okay, what are we going to find in here? We've got a lockbox of some, of some description, or just a drawer. Oh, okay, just some gold. Nothing terrible. Get a little bit of EXP here and there. This is good enough. I suppose I could go and draw that reverend out, but I'm wondering if really there's a need to do so. All right, let's explore the rooms over here first, and then we'll slowly start working our way through all of these things. We'll try out this room, and hopefully we'll be able to uh, get somewhere, but uh, we're going to have to try and lure them out, I think. So, with that said... I'm here. Let's get hmm? you into position right, just by here. That'll do. There's quite a lot of them in there. Dread. I think I've drawn a little bit too much attention. Okay, let's swap to my bow. Get you over there, get you there, there. I would like you to use... Pray Against Infirmity. Go ahead. That'll do. And next up... Where's that chill fog? Oh, actually, that's you. Let's get this just over there. We'll have to wait for it, but uh, it's good enough, I think. About there. Perfect. Very, very nice. Alright, start attacking. You attack. You attack. Hopefully you can just hold this, but uh, we'll actually give you armor of faith as well. That's nice. That's a really nice pos position for that spell. How are you doing? You're regenerating your endurance pretty well. Oh, that's glorious. That is absolutely fantastic. Though, let me just double check. You're not actually receiving... No, you're just getting hit by things. I don't think you're actually getting cold. That was fantastic. That's one spell there. Oh, no, 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 no. Get back. Get back. I don't... Uh, damn it, you've already engaged, haven't you? Hmm? Okay, well, we're just going to have to hope that you can deal with that. Leave just accept me. it. There we go. Oh. That was yes. a okay. potentially difficult fight. But worked out really well. We'll take all of that. Mm -hmm. Laying low. Okay. Right, and what are we going to fight? Ay, 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 ay. Hmm? Could you possibly disarm this trap? No. I do not want mm -hmm. to trigger it. Thank you. Mm -hmm. No. Mm -hmm. I will sooner not have to deal with that. The bite marks on these bones appear to be the proper size for folk and elven teeth. Well, yes. I mean, we, we more or less saw that. Gouge marks and scratches are lying the edge of the lid. Not good. Okay, can you disarm this trap? No. I'm here. Okay, well, uh, we're not going to play around with those. I'm just flat out not going to risk you guys playing around with stuff like that. Can't believe how well you did in that fight. There's a revenant just out there. Hey, How about you just pop down here, stand here, draw their attention. Hello. That's right. Draw him over here. And everyone attack. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What have you got equipped? No, no, no. We want you to be equipped with your rod. Thank you. Wow, again? Okay, well, we'll do exactly the same thing we did last time. That worked so well. There's absolutely no reason not to. Get that going. Attack the human skeleton. Yes. There we go. 
You attack the skeleton. You attack the skeleton. We'll take the skeleton out while he just works on the reverend. Oh dear. What happened there? It looks like you may have been hit. No, it was just slash damage. Okay, well, go ahead and... Oh, actually, no, he's what? fine for uh, endurance. You three attack the skeleton next. Hopefully that revenant comes and joins us. Ooh. He just got hit by a lot of freeze damage. Just pull out of it. All right, then. There we go. That was unfortunate. We got hurt by our own spell. But that spell combo in the doorway, so powerful. Absolutely amazing. And it looks mm -hmm. like it's gone. Indeed. Uh, actually, quite a lot of stuff there. Hmm? I'll see what I can find. And how close are we to our next level? Practically on top of it. Let's see what there is to find around this side of the sewers. Uh, okay, well, uh, we've been discovered, so not a lot we're going to be able to do about that. It's taken a lot of damage. We should be okay. In the meantime, though, can you perhaps knock it down? I'm not sure this is going to work, because how would you knock down ooze? There we go. I'm here. Not bad. I shall be discreet. Mm, another one. Let's go ahead and unlock this. Yes. It's done. Ooh, let's not go in there for now. Let's continue scouting around. Little by little. Got plenty of places that we can play when we want to, but not very many. What's this? Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. What's this? Not. F no, 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 no. That's bad. That is so bad. Yes. Oh, so close. You fool. But we've not got. Oh much in terms of uh, ability to rest, which is a bit of a pain. There we go. Let's see what we can find over here then. Doesn't look like too much, but this is a, a way out, so we could just leave and get more camping supplies if we had to. It would cost us time, and I got a feeling that time is going to hurt us if we take too much of it. But it is definitely an option. Let's go ahead and well the moment we come out of stealth. Hey. That thing's gonna Oh no, okay. Oh, Fair enough. Right then. Now let's wait for them to join us. See if we can't get into a position where we're gonna be able to No, they're not. Okay, you guys engage down there. You engage there. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, that's really not going to work. So you swap and engage. As for you, hmm. I could use that and it would hurt some of the uh, undead, it seems. Mm -hmm. We'll save our spells for now. We'll just see how this goes. That is actually hurting Glindu a fair bit. Okay, that's not good. Let's uh, get you a little closer and proc this ability. There we go. That should be doing a fair chunk of damage to them. Uh, can I summon skeletons? Yes, I can. I'm here. Fantastic, get them all involved. That's what we want to see. It's exactly what we need to see. Huge amount of flanking damage happening. Well done. Engage. I'll have to swap you back to this. Unfortunately, my skeletons are not going to be able to do a whole lot. I suppose I could charge them into other places. 
have them scout out. Ah, damn it, they're gone. Hey. I was hoping we could use them for a little bit of free scouting. Alas, no. Hmm? Nice and quiet. Oh, well, there's loads of things in here. There's a way up as well, which is uh, useful. Uh, sure, we'll take this. And what have we got here? Ah! Scallywaggery! Boots of stability. Sturdy. Plus 20 defense against prone attacks. Plus 15 defense against push attacks. Those are actually really good. We'll uh, get you set up with those. Oh, you know what? I'm walking around in this rubbish. Uh, it's frankly amazing that we've been doing okay for so long. I mean, I guess it doesn't really matter for them, because no one but uh, Ida has been tanking, but <laughs> I can't believe I completely forgot about that. Yes. Oh, dear me. But that's quite amazing that they've been doing that well, considering that. Easy now. Quite amazing, in my opinion. Okay, let's... You know what? Let's pull back and go back up to the area that we just opened the door to. Why not? There's going to be cells in here somewhere. I'm sure of it. This is the dungeon. Where else would you send captives than to the dungeon? Let's find out what this is. Blood smeared on the wall in the vague shape of letters. Whatever it once said has been obscured. By crimson handprint. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'll handle this. Right, it's unlocked. A uh, simple test. Ah, uh, damn it. That's too hard for me to uh, lockpick. We need more mechanics. Few bloody fingernails are embedded in the dirt. Ugh, that's not good. But that looks to be one of the uh, survivors. Ooh, can we not talk to you? No, okay. Get me out of the cell, please. I'll do my best. Let's try and move away from that skeleton and just slip straight through. Well, that was a red one as well. That's this. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, ah, that's course. so close. What? You wouldn't mind that's disarming that? That's no? Old. Okay, let's hey. try it with you. Hmm? No. Indeed. Okay. Hey. Very well. All right, Not disarming then. those traps, apparently. What? But that's fine, we can just sneak around. How may I help? Of I course. assume. If it makes you rest easier. All right, what are we going to find in here? Lots of barrels. Ooh, okay, this is part of the actual castle. Some camping supplies. Hurrah! <laughs> we are saved, everyone! Ah, oh, thank goodness. Yeah, we use four lockpicks on this. That's I like the way that lockpicks are used in this, actually. Oh, man, that was completely not worth it. How about this one? That would have been worth it if that was actually one of the locked chests. But it was not. I used my lockpicks pointlessly. Ooh. Okay. Let's get you in the hey, doorway. Of course. Uh, well, it doesn't actually look like they're going to be an issue. As long as you draw them into the same sort of fight. Oh my god, there's a lot of them. Hello. Would run, 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 run. Okay. Ooh. Cold. Out there, please. Huge amount of cold. Just past that door. No. Yes. Right, have you attack. Have you attack. Actually, that, that red doesn't seem to... Um, imply what I thought it did. I'm not really sure what it means. Right, let's get that going as well. 
Right, we should be good for this entire fight now. Let's just keep a watch over you. Oh, no, 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 no. That is bad news. Why would you do this? I don't want you moving. I just want you flat out staying where I tell you to stay. Okay. No. That's it. That's right. Let them come to you. Perfectly fine. We can finish them off. I'm here. Okay. And you just okay. stay there. Leave there we go. Me. And that should be the end of this revenant. Well done. Awesome tactic is awesome. Mm. My lord. Why would yes. anyone do anything else? Margarine's fire cast light. Right, what are we going to find in here then? The tank is warm to the touch. The glass vibrates with the bubbling fluid inside. Blood and flecks of, of dried flesh encrust the restraints. This is not a nice place. This is not the sort of place that is made by nice people. Psalm to Woodica. Uh, we'll pick that up, but I'm not going to read it right now. And we've got a door over there. Uh, we need just a Onion. little bit more EXP, I fancy. Oh, wait. Level up! <laughs> oh, gloriousness. Yes. Oh, <laughs> damn it. We need four points now to advance. Scallywaggery. Um... We could go for some athletics, maybe. Uh, let's see. I'm going to save the rest. I want to get mechanics on the next level up. I want to keep pushing mechanics. That seems like a very important one. So, yes. Right, we get a new one now. We could go... This is an invocation. Not felled by the axe, nor broken by the storm. Plus 5 damage reduction against Slash, plus 10 damage reduction against Shock. Thrice was she wronged, and thrice justly avenged. Uh, drains electrostatic energy from the environment to create 3 bolts of lightning, causing shock damage to any in the path. Uh, white wounds rise in the bellies of the dead. You know, I really should be using his chance much more often. But... That seems like an alright one, but... No, I think we're going to go with this one. Ooh, talents. Wow, okay. We can go with class talents, beloved spirits. Improve the chanter's connection to the soul fragments they employ, increasing ancient memory's healing capability. We can go for offensive, weapon focus adventurer. Grants weapon focus adventurer, effects plus six accuracy, polax, air stock, flail, wand, and warbow. Knight, noble, peasant, ruffian, soldier, savage attack. Uh, grant Savage Attack, Speed Instant Effects, User 1.2 Melee Damage, Minus 5 Melee Accuracy, Marksman, Plus 5 Accuracy Against Distant Enemies, Dangerous Implement, uh, with Implements, I'm not sure what Implements are, Increased Damage Done by Implements, Wands, Scepters and Rots, ah, right, okay, Beast Slayer, Primal Bane, Oh, there's so many things. Hold the line, snakes reflexes. Utility, fast runner. Move speed, defense when disengaging. Deep pockets, plus two quick item slops. Ooh, that might be useful. Arms bear, plus one weapon set. Shoot on the run. Minus 25% ranged recovery when moving. Scion of flame, plus five damage reduction. Uh, let's see, Secrets of Rhyme, Quick Switch, Wound Binding, User plus 84.8 .8 health over 11.3 seconds, allows the healing of modest amount of health on the user. Wow! Field Triage, allowing the healing of a small amount of health on an ally. Those are amazing. I wasn't aware that there was any way of healing health. But that's actually amazing. 
I'm going to go with field triage. There we go. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. I am very, very happy with this. Also, we now have enough to access that door. But we're not going to do that in this episode. We shall do that in the next. In fact, I should be able to oh, yeah. use your uh, field triage on him. It really doesn't do that much. Oh, no, it, it restores it over time, doesn't it? Ah, yes, okay. That is not too bad. An extra 40 health, you know, nothing to sniff at, certainly. It's not amazing, but it, it might uh, save someone's life in a pinch. But that's going to be it for this episode. I do hope you've enjoyed and will be joining me for the next. But until then, and as always, do take care.